after she and her daughter spotted the missing teen from Bonnie Lake on Sunday, will be getting a $10,000 reward. Yeah, I spoke with her today and coordinated the efforts to make sure that she's getting the money. After law enforcement confirmed she was not involved in the case in any way, just a good Samaritan. Now, she asked not to be identified. She's a very private person. But she and her daughter are heroes tonight at providing this tip to police. I was leaving um, the, the place. And a girl was walking down, and she looks like that girl that's missing. And she has a beanie on, and she's at a bus stop. Well, that 15-year-old girl, who we are no longer naming or showing because police say she was a victim of sex trafficking, is home safe tonight because of the efforts of the community. The Facebook page created to help find her now has a new name, South Sound Advocates for the Missing and Endangered. And already today, the members are hard at work trying to help locate another missing girl. Thurston County Sheriff's detectives are searching for 16-year-old Emmy Pierce. She ran away 83 days ago. Today, her mother provided a DNA sample to detectives in case it's ever needed to help identify Emmy. And just like in the case of the Bonnie Lake teen, Emmy left around 1 a.m. by sneaking out a window after her mom says they had a great evening together planning her grandmother's birthday party. I'm desperate for answers. I don't know why she's gone, why she left. I don't have, I just have nothing. And she's been gone for 83 days today. She is 5'5", 140 pounds with blue eyes and brown hair. She has piercings in her nose, tongue, ear, and belly. Call 911 if you see her. Now, her mom says Emmy had some struggles in the past. But after getting counseling, her mom thought she was doing better. She doesn't know what to think now and fears the worst. On any given night, experts say there are 500 girls being trafficked sexually in western Washington, some as young as 12 years old, Marnie. Yeah, and David, we wanted to highlight that. Her mom reported her to the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. The Washington State Patrol has this missing persons website. It shows posts of photos and names of runaways. They are tough for law enforcement because there really is no law against running away, but they do put out internal bulletins for patrol officers. And you can see here all of the faces. I counted there are 55 currently on this site, including uh, Lindsey Baum, who they're going to take off, who we know uh, she was murdered. But if they think a child might be in danger or missing because of a suspicious circumstance, they put out an alert to law enforcement. Emmy's case, she had run away before, so her mom was worried that her case was not going to be taken seriously. She has been posting photos of her daughter on every Facebook page that she can find. I feel hopeful. Yes. I'll keep my faith no matter what, you know, and I won't give up on my daughter, but um, I'm pretty heartbroken. I just need some answers. There is a nonprofit organization that runs a hotline to help teens reconnect with their families. This is the Facebook page, and they can call 1 800 The Runaway and even get a free bus ticket home. I think it highlights one, that it needs community support to find these kids, bring them home, but we have to keep talking about it, right? I mean, that page is one example, yeah. but all the flyers that went out for the Bonnie Lake teen just letting the community know this person is loved, they're missing, their family wants them back. Well, it certainly has created a conversation, and it did for the heroes in the Bonnie Lake case. She has a teenage daughter, and she said word about what happened to that teen certainly sparked a discussion in her family, and hopefully in a lot of families with teenage girls about the real dangers that are out there, both online and in real life. And again, if you know where Emmy is or you have any information, please contact the Thurston County Sheriff's Department. All right. We've got some spectacular new videos.